All right, straight into it. I have a got a the simple scene here just to demonstrate. It's just a inverted box here with some objects with one Arnold light. So the panorama will be in the dead center. So first things first is we need a uh, Arnold VR camera, which would be in the cameras area. Just on a, under Arnold, we can just throw one of these in. Now it's going to set this to zero. Got to move it up a bit. I'm going to make sure that it is um, rotated the right way as well. So yeah, that would do. Position up a bit more. Now over in the VR camera settings here, we got to change the uh, the mode to left eye. Uh, these other modes will sort of like render multiple eye views in the same image. So we only need one. So we'll just use left or right. Uh, we also need to set eye separation to zero. Otherwise it will add sort of like a distortion. And the rest of these things are fine. Now we just got to enter a render settings. The only thing you really need to change is the resolution. Um, you need to keep it at basically two by one. So it's 8K by 4K here is probably the maximum you want to go to showcase something. Now this is this is pretty big, so you, you can cut it lower. You can go like 6,000 by 3,000 or 4K by 2K. But obviously with the lower res, you get more pixelization. All right, so now we can just have the uh, VR camera in the viewport, which is, let's change this. So it will look really, really distorted, which is fine. Just don't change anything, never move it. And if we just make sure the VR camera is selected and we render this out, you'll get something like this. Now we just need to save this out. I just saved it as a uh, tiger, TGA. I'm going to open this up in a uh, Photoshop. I did a really fast render here, just using preview settings, just to, you know, save time. But this is a 8K uh, image, eight by 4,000. All right, so now we just want to export this and we want to save it as a JPEG. We just need to make sure that um, the file size is under eight megabytes. So we can bump this up so we get to around eight. So I'm going to go 5.8 here. It's the best I can do. Okay. Now over at our art station, we can just upload, um, the JPEG that we exported. Now if that's uploaded, we can save it and then just preview. And here's our panorama. Thanks for watching and take care.